Hey, stick with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to transfer your photos and videos from your iPhone to your MacBook in a couple different ways. So let's get started. Now, the simple and the easiest way to transfer quickly from your iPhone to your MacBook, if it's a photo that you want to transfer a video, you can simply go ahead and open up your albums here, click on select and select the ones that you want to do. Now you have to select it by hand and then click on the share icon up here. And then after that, you'll click on AirDrop and your device for your eye. MacBook should show up. Now, if it doesn't show up, make sure that for allow me to be discovered by everyone or contact only so that your iPhone can detect the MacBook. Now, this is one way and this step takes a little bit longer, especially if you have a lot of photos and videos you want to transfer, which brings up us to the second way that we can transfer photos and videos. And that's going to be signing into the same Apple account that you have on your iPhone into your MacBook by going into your Apple icon up top here and then after that you can go into your system preferences but if you have a newer MacBook it might be under just uh, the iPhone set uh, MacBook setting and then you can click on that and then make sure here you're signed in so click on sign in in the same account that's on here so you want to sign in right with that email account that we have and then after you sign in all of your data will be synced with your MacBook which opens up the photos app like you have on your iPhone right the same exact app is on your MacBook and what you'll do is click on the photos app and your photos will start syncing of course make sure you're connecting your MacBook to your, the internet and the sync process will happen where whatever you take on your phone will also appear on your MacBook in the photos app now a third method is if you don't want to connect your iPhone directly to your MacBook you can use a cable to transfer your photos and videos especially if you have a lot all you'll do is take your cable that you use for charging right connect it to your iPhone just like that and then go ahead and connect it to your MacBook and once you're connected you might get a screen that says trust so you want to trust the device and I don't need to update any of this and you can see here all the photos and videos I have on my iPhone right are also now available here under the devices here section of the photos app here and in order to import the videos or save it to my MacBook I can do is select them like this and once you select them right all you do is click on import selected and under the import section your photos and videos will be imported to your MacBook from your computer this is much quicker and easier because you have access to all of your photos and videos and you can do it as well and let's say you under devices again we go back to our iPhone we want to do all the photos and videos we can click on that one option that says import all new photos and videos and it will import all the photos and videos that we have that already aren't on your MacBook so that's how you transfer your photos and videos from your iPhone to your MacBook. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.